Welcome back to the Creating Pages with eComposer series. Today's video will show you step by step how to export or import a page, template, and section using eComposer Shopify Page Builder. The export feature helps you export and download your page as a file to your computer. And the import feature allows you to import the page, section, and template file from your computer to eComposer. You can import a layout under another layout in eComposer just by opening an existing layout or create new for imported layout. If you have already built stunning pages, templates or sections in eComposer, this feature helps you store them on your devices as a permanent backup. Or in the case that you want to quickly transfer pages from your current store to other stores so that you don't have to build pages from the beginning. Before we start, don't forget to hit the thumbs up and subscribe button for our channel. If you don't have a Shopify account, feel free to click on the link we attached in the description below. The newest Shopify exclusive deal is waiting for you. Now, go to the Shopify dashboard, select App, and open eComposer Landing Page Builder. In case you haven't installed the app, you can find the link to eComposer on Shopify App Store in this video description. Next, I will show you how to export and import pages, templates, or sections using eComposer. The first is how to export. So from the eComposer app dashboard, click on a template, page, or section you want to export. In the eComposer editor, click on Publish. At the General tab, change the title. This name is also your export file name. Next at the top right side, click on the drop-down arrow next to publish and choose export as a file or select the export current layout to file button in the left corner of the screen. Exported files will be in .ecom format and located in your device's download section. Next, let's learn how to import a template, page, or section into eComposer. First, you should start from a new blank page. Please access the eComposer app dashboard, select start building. Here, you need to select blank template, give it a name, and click Start Building. In the eComposer editor, click Import Star.ecom file or click the Import Layout from File button here. At the pop up that appears, click Add File and select the file you want to import. Next, you need to select Options to import. There are a total of five options. The data section helps you enter codes automatically. Page settings help you import all settings from file. Site styles are to import all styles from file. Global fonts and colors help you import all fonts and colors sections. Finally, custom CSS, JS. If the file has custom CSS, JS, you can choose to import it or not. In all of these items, note that you must select the data item, then proceed to select other items. Finally, simply click Import to have your layout visible on this new page and you can continue working on this design. That is the end of today's Create Pages with eComposer episode. Remember to subscribe and turn on the notification to get the newest videos from our channel. Feel free to leave a comment or join the eComposer community to get quick support and the latest updates. Thank you for watching. See you next time.